Our first looks coverage is proudly powered by the Microsoft Store. Get your next laptop, tablet, Xbox, and more by going to firstlooks.tv slash Microsoft. And we have our next interview up. Hi, can you introduce yourself to us and our viewers? Hi, I'm Hope. Hi, Hope. Hi, Hope. Hi. What team are you with? Um, I'm with the RoboGeeks, Team 8152. So Ooh. what do you do on the RoboGeeks? Um, really, I'm just one of the extras. Um, I'm good at programming, so I do a lot of the missions. And sometimes I help a bu build attachments or modify them if we need to. Wow. But most of the time, I'm just one of the ones there for backup. Okay. So what's your favorite thing about being on this robotics team? Probably the programming. The programming. It's fun. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Um, it's, it's fun to, like, learn how to do things. Like, my team recently had some trouble with the color sensor. We didn't know how to do it. So it's fun to learn how to do it and figure it out yourself. So what's the color sensor and how does that apply to the game? Um, so there are lines on the board and we had to follow them. And so we were using the line sensor to get pipe removal and we couldn't figure it out. So we looked it up a few times, tried to find some things and we finally figured out how to do it. And it actually worked very well. So that's, well, awesome. that's pretty cool. How long have you been with the team? Um, this is my third year okay. um, and my last because I had to go to middle school and our team is in an elementary school. Oh, All right. Okay. How old are you? Um, 12, 11. <laughs> I'm about to be 12. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice. So do you plan on continuing with first? Yes. Yeah? If my middle school has a team, I will. Okay. Well, that's really cool. So what's your favorite thing about coming to competitions like these? Um, probably like the... The anxiety you get from it. The like anxiety, ooh. Yeah. <laughs> so you like the excitement. Yeah. Yeah. So do you mm -hmm. like cheer on, cheering on your team? Like how, t tell us about your team dynamic. Um, I really like it all, honestly. Um, we have a lot of cheers that we do at the table or when we're walking into one of the judging rooms. It's, we just keep fun going. Okay. That's pretty how cool. How many members are on your team? Eight. Yes, eight. <laughs> and how many girls? Three and one's not here right now because she's in Costa Rica with her grandma and she's oh. very sick. Oh, okay. Well, how is your team faring today at competition? Um, very well. We got a program in last minute. That was the color sensor one. We just perfected it. Um, Ooh. so we have I think it's 125 points on the board right now. Our max is 135, but we're still waiting to perfect some of those programs. Do you have a favorite memory? on your team in this last three years? Ooh. Do you have something that like really jumps out? Um, my first year on the team, um, after we got through and we made it out of everything and we had no more competitions left, we had kind of like a playtime with all the robots. And my friends, Jacob, who's no longer on the team, and Ethan, who is still on the team, um, they made an automatic toenail clipper and they really just <laughs> had like a really long axle connected to like two um, NXT motors because that was when we were using NXTs. They had a really long axle with a bunch of just like pins on it. <laughs> that is that was fun. awesome. Whoa. That is awesome. And then when was this? Uh, two years ago. Two years ago. That's yeah. pretty cool. I mean, so does first inspire you to and like your career Whoa. path or what you want to study? Well, later on? Yeah, it yeah. it's just fun. It's like when I get older and I use more of the complicated ones like HTML or Python. That's gonna be a lot of fun. Oh, so you want to continue on to programming, huh? Yes. Yeah. So what do you think is the best thing about being a part of FIRST? Mmm, that's hard. <laughs> there are a lot of things. Um, probably just like the intelligence you get from it. All the things you learn, all the things you get to know, the things you already know which can help out your team. It's fun. But what do you want to do when you grow up, exactly? Uh, I don't, I, I don't know. You don't know yet? I, like, my dad works at Northrop Grumman, so I think I kind of want to go over there. Okay. So that might be Ooh. fun. All right. Fun. Well, yeah. you have plenty of time to think about <laughs> it. Yeah. <laughs> but um. first has definitely influenced both of our career paths, so that's why we're asking. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Continue on. Is there, like, how's, uh, we asked about the competition now. What about how's your season been? Good enough. <laughs> <laughs> We had some problem with the program that we had. Um, we were doing filter and rain in one program, and we had it so it did both of them for um, qualifier, and we never touched that program, and we added a median motor onto a robot, and when we went to run it just for a test run to make sure it was still working, it, it was going crazy. <laughs> It wow. was messed up, and so we had to. We were trying to fix it, and then we were just like, "Whatever," and we completely redid it again. We only got one. We only got filter done, so we just added rain, and now it's on the board for 
Let me do it. <laughs> nice. Is this your first time being at a regional championship? Actually, yes. <laughs> it is? <laughs> yeah. And how is that for you? It's nerve-wracking. <laughs> nerve-wracking? <laughs> yeah. I'm really worried about what we're going to do. Yeah? How's yeah. your day been so far, though? Good. Good? Yeah. Yeah. Are you still nervous? Yes. Even after being here <laughs> half a day? Yeah, we still have two more table runs to do, so I don't oh, know okay. how those are going to turn out. I know when I was walking around trying to get interviews this morning, everyone seemed really busy. Yeah. So. <laughs> and we so know awesome. it's not just about the robots. There's also a research project you've done. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Um, my team has chosen to do aquaponics. Um, we have compared aquaponics to hydroponics. They're two different things. Aquaponics, you use a fish to grow plants. Hydroponics is the same thing, but you have to keep adding chemicals to it, and the fish is not safe to eat. With the aquaponic, you can't eat the fish. So with an aquaponic, you benefit both ways, but with the hydroponic, you only grow the fish. Okay. Okay. So yeah. You think it's a, have you done judging yet? Um, actually, yes. That was the first thing we did. We had it back to back to back. Wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> and how was that? It was nerve-wracking, cracking too. <laughs> uh, do you think uh, first is helping you get over all this like fear and anxiety of all this? It's helping yes. you <laughs> learn how to deal with it. Yeah, for Project Our Skit, um, I was a Girl Scout because I was eating too many cookies, and so the Girl Scout team <gasps> was right ahead of us. So oh. the lady was like pointing at me because I had it in. I had it on. I have two characters. But I had, that was, was the first one on, so I had on my vest. And she was like, Girl Scouts, come this way. And I was like, oh, no, no, <laughs> I want this team. <laughs> That's oh. so funny. So That's have funny. you, like, seen anything about First Tech Challenge? Um, FTC? No. Or the continuing on <laughs> for when you get out of middle school into high school? Um, those kind of teams. The other robotics competitions. Yeah, um, I've seen like pictures of what state looks like and stuff, and I, I'm just there like, uh, <laughs> I'm really worried if we do get go on. Mm -hmm. um, I'm sure you'll do fine. Well, um, does your team have a website or any social media? No, not really, actually. <laughs> no. Well, oh, can nice. you repeat the name of your team? Um, the Robo Geeks Team Eight One Five Two. Okay. And I was hoping if you could possibly look into this mirror and if you had any look into this camera and ask if you could ask an astronaut any question, what would it be about like human exploration in space? Because that's your challenge next year, right? Is it? Oh yeah. Oh, <laughs> that's a, oh. That's the first like elite <laughs> challenge next year. So we're asking kids right now, of, like, well, if you could ask an astronaut, what would it be? Oh. Do you really jump that high when you're on the moon? Oh, <laughs> that's nice. a good one. That is All a right. cool one. All right. Well, thank you very much for speaking with us today. You're welcome. Thank you. We wish you all the luck with the rest of your day. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Mm -hmm.